Right, ladies and gentlemen, this is an exquisite um, early 19th century. It could be late Georgian. It could be 1830s. It could be 1840s. It is a brooch of exceptionally high quality. Um, there's the back. There's the front. It's made of it. It's sort of hand finished. It hasn't really been cast. It's been sort of stippled. You can see within the octagon there, all the background is sort of very crisply stippled. This is extremely low resolution um, uh, mobile phone um, uh, filming. But you can see the item is almost like a sort of Renaissance jewel there. The background has been hand stippled. All of these little floral things seem to have been hand chased. Uh, and the stones, these are not great very well up on, 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 on stones or jewels. These two look like sort of opals of some sort, the little white ones. I cannot guarantee what the others are. They're probably glass, but there's a pinkish colored stone and there's a rather lovely um, um, uh, green stone there. Uh, I don't know what it is, um, but uh, the brooch is obviously a uh, uh, rather sort of precious because on the back it's got uh, there's the back as i say the brooch is copper beautifully covered over with with a sort of rich buttery gold um the, the pin when open wobbles a little from side to side but when closed it doesn't come undone but the brooch is obviously rather precious it's got a sort of hook there perhaps for hooking over a over a um a little chain which once sort of held it on but um it's not a sort of um cheap mass-produced item. It's a, it's a sort of handcrafted uh, brooch, which can be worn that way. It's rather handsome that way, I think, uh, or that way. And it has a look of the sort of late Georgian first part of the Victorian era about it, although obviously modelled on lavish sort of Stuart, uh, Elizabethan, uh, or later, slightly later sort of Baroque jewellery. Lovely, lovely, classy piece of fine 19th century jewellery. There we are. A delight to the eye. Thanks very much indeed. And much crisper in reality. Thanks. Bye.